not a test. This is your emergency broadcast system. May God be with you all. On this field yesterday, an epic struggle took place. John Carroll's field hockey team took on Indian Creek in the IAMM B Conference semifinals. In one of the greatest games to ever take place on our new turf fields, the Patriots emerged victorious. Everyone expected a terrific match, but no one could have expected the drama that was to unfold on this beautiful fall afternoon. Indian Creek struck first with an early goal, but JC answered with a second half goal by Emily Stanley. So the game headed to overtime, tied one all. Just as time was winding down in the first OT period, the winning goal was scored by Charlotte Hagery, who scored the winner in last year's double overtime victory. But in a dramatic and potentially heartbreaking turn of events, it was ruled that the clock had run out and the goal was waved off. where Patriot pride took over. It would have been easy to feel cheated or defeated, or to just roll over and give up, or to at least make some nasty remarks to the referees. But none of that happened. They handled the situation with such class that one of the referees called it the greatest example of sportsmanship she'd ever seen. There was still a game to be won, and the Patriots dug deep. They found some inner reserves that maybe even they didn't know they had. Coaches Gary Scholl and Katie Hastings didn't deliver any fiery speeches. They didn't need to. When Charlotte Haggerty, Sam Carey, Carly Lyon, Claire Grimwald, Emily Stancliffe, Ashley Cotenbutel, and goalie Emma Grimacki took the field for the final 7-on-7, seven seven, they did so with a quiet determination for a second overtime to try and win the game a second time. Indian Creek was energized by their new lease on life and fought hard for every loose ball. Fans of both teams were making some noise. Then, Emily Stancliffe, who had scored JC's first goal, went down with a knee injury, bringing Alyssa Krause into the game. But finally, with less than five minutes left in the second OT, this. by Carly Lyon, assisted by Charlotte. An epic victory for an epic team. Next up, Maryvale, in the finals on Sunday, 12 noon, at Mustang Stadium at Stevenson University. Admission is $8, and if this game is any indication, it should be worth it. Get out there and support your team. And go Patriots! Let's bring home that championship again, ladies. The football team, coached by Mr. Keith Rawlings, are on an undefeated season streak as well. They have found themselves beating teams such as St. Paul, Calvert Hall, Loyola, and many more. They will hopefully find themselves on the way to the championships. Signing all from the JCTV News, stay scared, Patriots.
Hi, I'm Bob.